Twelve Mighty Orphans, a football film that was limited in theaters and has just hit streaming. Is this the next Remember the Titans? Find out my thoughts next. Hello and welcome to my channel. This is Reviews with Ryan. Today I'm going to be talking about 12 Muddy Orphans. This is directed by Ty Roberts and stars Luke Wilson, Martin Sheen, Vanessa Shaw, and Wayne Knight. The film is set in 1930s during the Great Depression. This devoted coach is leading a bunch of scrawny orphans to a state championship. Now, Luke Wilson and Martin Sheen, they have fine performances in this. However, the orphans that are in this film, they don't really add a lot to the film. They're just kind of there and the characters are kind of forgettable. The emotions of the characters seem a little forced at times rather than earned. Also in the film, they have like an inspirate, a few inspirational moments in the film. Martin Sheen, he narrates and he kind of talks about the formations and he talks about the different orphans and such as the movie is going on. It almost feels like they have a little bit of documentary type of style, a little bit into it, as well as the movie uh, just kind of playing out as well. So that is kind of a little bit interesting. If you don't know about football, it kind of fills you in with the different formations now that we have with football. And also with the film, it just doesn't measure up to a Remember the Titans. It's kind of a forgettable film. To me, this is the type of film where it's just released too late. I feel like we have so many football films. And this is good, I guess, if you're into the formations and how we got a little bit into the football game. However, is it kind of a memorable type film? For me, it's not. It actually has a little bit of connection with my wife because it was filmed at her high school. So that was really cool. I think she was a little biased and she liked it a little bit more than I did. For me, it's just a very formalic football film. And I would say that if you're not really into football films, this is not gonna change your perspective. Honestly, I think at times this movie is a little bit too slow and at times gets a little boring at times. And what's interesting is at the end of the film, they do uh, talk about the orphans. They tell where they've gone and what happened in their life. And so it is based on a true story and such. And that is really cool. It's just, I guess, the way it's told. And the film just seems like it's released like really late. Like it should have been released maybe like in like the mid 2000s. It just feels really out of date. I'm gonna give this film a two and a half out of five. It's an okay watch. I mean, it's a watch that you can get through and it's not completely terrible. It's just not a very memorable film for me. Thank you guys for watching this review. Let me know what you guys think of this film if you do get a chance to watch it. Like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you guys for checking out this review and I'll see you guys in my next one.